Uh, here you go. Albert Mesa says, Robert Ryan Craig Chamberlain, in your opinions, what makes a good WordPress website? Well, for me, again, how sound is the SEO architecture on the site? What are the main objectives of the site? And how well does the site achieve those objectives? Again, you know, the look and feel, that should only really chime with the target market to a degree. You know, beyond that, it's how well, you know, I don't care what the site looks like if it gets a lot of leads and if it gets a lot of conversions. So that's, that's for me, is, is the metric of what would make a good website or a good WordPress website. My, Obviously, I mean, you don't want it to be a, a horror show. And, <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. If it's got good information, mm. sometimes it doesn't even matter. Yeah. Uh, I yeah. mean, if I, if I find you on a Google search and you're in the top 10, I don't care how your site looks. You made it to the top 10, it's usually worth looking at. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. But but uh, you're right. It, it My opinion of a good site's changed pretty dramatically, and it's, it's very similar to what you're saying is now. How well is structured is it and how bogged down is it? Uh, load times are essential now for me, um, and I, until I got this W3 total cash figured out, my load times on mine were terrible. Um, but a, a good set of load times, uh, good site structure, as you say, good SEO, uh, and good good use of header tags and, and pictures and layouts on photos, I think that's a big part of it. WordPress makes it so easy. Mm. So really, people don't have a lot of excuses there. I don't think. Uh, but yeah. I like I like one that's visually appealing. Uh, but it's not necessary. <laughs> well, I suppose like one one caveat when I say the visuals aren't the be all and end all. What Craig mentioned there with regards to formatting are absolutely vital, uh, and that is within your blog post and within your actual on page. You want to make it so that's very very easy for people to to read. You don't want to give people a huge chunk of text. And it's just going to be too daunting for them. And straight away, they're going to bounce. So present whatever your content is, and you know, with bullet points, with nice headers, italics, just so visually, it uh, people will be able to engage with it. Um, that's my little caveat. 